Alright, so guys, this is a video on how to get wireless on your, either an old computer, an Xbox, pretty much anything that doesn't have wireless and not have to pay the $100 for the uh, wireless card. Like on the Xbox 360, I was about to buy one, but I figured out how to do this and I just saved myself 100 bucks. So let's get started. This is for Windows 7 and Vista only, because Windows XP you have to do more stuff, but yeah. Make sure that your computer does not fall asleep or the screen dims if you're playing the Xbox. Otherwise, it will shut off the internet for it and it will recognize your computer and not let you go on internet from it again. But computer, just make sure that doesn't go into sleep mode and I'm pretty sure you'll still have internet. But yeah, this can all, for me, I found that it can also speed up your internet. So if you're having like slow download speeds, you can just plug it into here and I got about 700 kilobytes a second wirelessly. So, what you're going to need is an Ethernet cord, um, one second, uh, no, alright, so, what you're going to do, you're going to need an Ethernet cord, and you're going to plug that into whatever you're trying to get, and plug it into the computer with the wireless, that, that's what you're using. I think it works on a desktop as long as it has wireless, but I think a laptop works best because you can move it around and stuff, but yeah. So what you're gonna do, you're gonna go to the start menu, and then you're gonna get a control panel. You're gonna go to network and internet right here, click it, and now you're gonna get a network and sharing center. Okay, now you're gonna see a screen like this. What you wanna do, you wanna get a change adapter settings. So right now it should say either an X, like right where my mouse is, or it'll say unidentified network, cause mine's plugged in to my desktop right now and that's what I've been using. I, the wireless has been broken for about a year. Finally got it fixed with this. But what you're gonna do is that you're gonna see local area connection and wireless network connection. You're gonna go to wireless network connection, right click right click it and click on properties. Okay. Now you're gonna now you're gonna see network and sharing. You're gonna you wanna get a sharing. Now you wanna do Allow other network users to connect through this air, through this computer's internet connection. Click on that, and then also it's gonna say, this box is gonna become available saying allow other network users to control or disable the shared internet connection. Click yes, and now click OK. Let save. Okay, now you're gonna see local area connection, and Right, if you had it on, then a little thing will say connected or something like that. But yeah, right now, like, like before, if there's an X, there should just be this now. Right here where it says unidentified, that's just because it isn't on right now. But yeah, that's how you do it. Short tutorial, comment, rate, and subscribe. See you guys.